here we're going to look at the in command series and connecting a 1200 in command display with the Agfinity mobile app. Two ways of doing this go to our data transfer here and you can choose our wireless network in range. Uh, if we're in the field, normally you'll probably choose an access point mode. Go ahead and check on that. It's going to ask you to restart and we'll let it do so. In this time period, we'll go over here to the iPad and we're going to click on our settings and Wi-Fi. and you'll see it pop up as being the in-command display. Go ahead and choose that one. Allow it to grab the network there. Yep. All right. Hop back over here to the data transfer window. We can go over here to the Xfinity mobile app itself. I like to go ahead and use the manual sync button. It prepares it. You can see data is now ready for mobile app. And we're going to want to keep reference up here. Get something that pops up here when it does handshake and connect with the uh, in command display. Go ahead and check on that. And you can see it's it's syncing up here and it's built, starting to build the maps. So when both of those are checked up there, you can see on the little blue indicator you're linked up and it's working. You can minimize that if you want. And you'll see a little icon up here on the Eggfinity letting you know that it is connected to the iPad. And that's in a nutshell on uh, getting connected. Hopefully this helps anyone that uh, has any troubles. I'm getting it to work.